Good evening, Type Knees. My name is Hyper Himes, and welcome to episode 23 of Terraria. In the last episode, I showed you a bit on how I wanted to build my house. And fun fact, that episode was recorded seven hours ago. What the f What was this here? You don't belong here. Get out of here. Shove. Anyway, I showed you the process of how I would usually build my houses. At least, especially these new ship-like ones. And I'm proud to say, we finished it. At least for the time being, until I make new add-ons in. Now, the goal of this episode is that I want to return to the dungeon, basically dungeoning part two, and I just, oh, you see that? I'm not going to spoil anything. Oh, you may saw a glimmer of it. All right, so you go up these nice silky ropes, and look at this. Check this out. Look at this. Look how awesome. Dude. You got these thrones, then you got these side wings. Freaking amazing. You got the candy girl, or the, you know, the party girl, Fantasia, over there. You got the mechanic, Autumn, down there, which is a, Autumn is a really fitting name. You got another ship with the wheel. You got three rooms up here. Oh, and you also got a witch doctor. Molly, may you help heal your body, but I can make him body healing. He also has a booing station, which you can use him craft these flask things, I guess. I'm gonna just buy one. Uh, he also has some water fountains, I guess. Hallowed. Ooh, is that a spoiler? Ooh. You have another room right here for skeleton people, and you have another room right here for pumpkin people. And then you can go up here and go through these nice little narrow hallways and enter another room. And, and over here, another room. Basically the same. I want to add more rooms up here, but right now, this is what we have, and honestly, it looks amazing. Now, this look, this, I'm going to call this the Jester House. Like, you have my normal ship, you know, the Hype Knee ship, and this is my Jester ship. Chaos ship. You know what? The chaos ship. That's what I'm going to call this. So, now that we have that settled and done, I'm going to land on this rail and go to the dungeon. And the reason why is because there's still some items that we need to get there. For example, the items that I know we... Son of a... Make me move forward. Make me move forward. Thank you. Do we want to go fishing? I'll do an all camera. Uh, but the weapons that we have so far is we got the alchemy cable, we got the bewitching stand, which, you know, the thing that summons more minions, and the thing that can uh, reduce his potion cost. We also got the bone wand, which places bones. But for weapon-wise, we got the phantom, uh, no, is that what it's called? Phantom blaster? It's, I think it, no, it's, I think it's a, I don't know, a pistol? The, the, the weapon, the gun from the dungeon, we got the Aqua Scepter, we got the Muramasa, we got the Blue Moon, we got the Water Bolt, and we also got the Clothier Voodoo Doll. We are missing a couple things, though, and some of the cooler things, too. I think it's not many things, but it's about, we still need to do about 75% of this, you know. The, are you kidding me, Clothier? Why are you there? Oh my gosh. You guys, you don't know the struggle of these plebs trying to move in places that I don't want to. By the way, I, I think I said this last episode, but I just messed it up entirely. Replace the Filet Thorn with the Aqua Scepter, because it does more damage, and I don't th I think it uses the same amount of mana, and also attacks qu quite quicker. So, we park here, go down here, and there we go. Now we can go back into the dungeon. Actually, I want to collect some of these books. Because this is going to be the round where I just absolutely loot the dungeon. Diabolsk lamp. A sigil. Light switch. That's going to be good for wiring and stuff like that. A pot that I didn't break for 10 silver. Okay, I did store my money before that. Uh, take these. My boy is summoned. That's great. Uh, that's just a slime. We get a decent amount of books. So you may see me. This may be a bit slower. But also more loot gathering. Okay, here comes the spooky music. The lamp. Is there a light switch somewhere? Ah, down here. Got the bookshelf. Also, whatever this thing is. Oh, it's another switch. Or was that not a light switch before? I don't know. I could get these spikes just to get them out of the way. But I think that's a lot of my time. I'd rather just get the, you know, the free stuff and get out of here. Let me just reposition myself and we should be good. And shoot a bunch of bees down there. Because the bees help. They would be amazing. I'm like the best at telling jokes and puns, I tell you. By the way, books look like this. Uh, it contains strange symbols. You write. K. 
Okay, if we go down further, we're going to encounter a lot of these. Hopefully, I can also get some golden keys while doing this. Just let the bees deal with them, though. Oh, and also the bees needs too. Can make sure, remember, I have that. And also, I got the Arcalis, so really, melee isn't too much of a problem for me. It's just how they approach me, you know? See, look, look at that. Magic. And a caster. Hey, get out of here. I'll take this. You got a lamp over there, which I'm also going to happily take that. Thank you. And also another banner. Oh, angry bones, angry boy. How dare ye? How dare ye try to attend to me? And try to smite thy fellow. Who art thou friendly with retribution? I don't think anyone got that, but I think even Shakespeare would be embarrassed that of my existence. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm trying to speak not English, but also English, if it makes sense. Okay, take some hanging skeletons. Those are nice. Switches. I definitely like having the switches and stuff like that. I really just like having decor just so I can have some stuff that I can use later to ca decorate other things with. Hence why I also love making houses. It's, it's kind of like extracting, really. You take this, you put it somewhere else, and not only is it somewhere else, it's a place that's a lot safer and nice. Which, honestly, would anyone want to live down here with all the skeletons? I mean, maybe if you're a skeleton yourself, and maybe. I mean, I wouldn't judge people who are skeletons. Boy, I know a character who's like the most lazy skeleton, and he's like, he's the best. There's a slime boy. All right. Spray them all. Just around this jungle chest. There we go. Got a golden key. So we can enter one of the chests. Finally. But where did I... Could I place a chest? Definitely not that. I think that's a... Yeah, that's a locked gold chest down there. But let me get this wall skeleton first. And that banner. Yeah, molten... I thought that said molten lag... <laughs> lagma. But no, it's just molten legion. Whoa, bees. It's brain prey. There we go. Oh, and also got the switch over there. Definitely going to be important. For whatever reason, I don't know. Just love having them. All these banners, all this skeleton loot. Ooh, chair. I'll take the chair. Did I get the... Okay, there we go. Gothic chair. Ooh, goth people. Interesting. Well, I mean, it is for the skeletons, but... At least they're not in your closet. But, um... Tss. I really hope that wasn't, like, accidentally, like, rude. And I just offended so many people by that. Hey, look, we got one of the new items. Okay, this is called a Valor. And it's godly. It's already better than the Code 1. This boy has 13 critical strike chances instead of 11. And this thing has fast speed, while this thing also has fast speed. And they both don't have the same knockback. This one has weak one. This one has average. So we're just going to swap that out. And we have a new and improved yo-yo. Which, honestly, I don't think I rely on the yo-yo enough on the series. Like, I don't really use much of the yo-yo. And it's not because I hate yo-yos. It's because there are other weapons that I just love. Though, granted, there is a, another yo-yo that we can get. Which I think is one of the final ones we can get uh, this early in the game. Uh, because this is, you know, this is pre-hard mode. Not hard mode. I will tell you when we enter hard mode. And it's going to be pretty obvious. Oh, look at all that. Freaking. What's it called? Furniture. Ikea would be impressed. And also all them books. 60 gonna be good? 60 is good for now. I'm gonna snag this up from the other side of the wall. I guess I can't. But I will still take this lamp and also that. Anything else? Aha, lamp. And also sigil thing with a switch. Ooh, furniture. Tables and some chairs. That'll be nice. Ooh, uh, catacomb. Love those. Hey, there you go. See, look. Getting furniture leads to riches. And also, while well, also enemy, but that leads to adventures. So we have another bone key. It's called bone... Yeah, well, they're just called golden keys, but... Yeah, whatevs. We can open the one that was also down here next to the other one. And we're starting to get a... Wreak havoc here. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. They're everywhere. I got another clove ear voodoo doll. Okay, swap the bow, just so I can regain my magic. The bow is really good for, like, direct contact strike. V's is really good for, like, 
Uh, the B gun specifically is good for swarming. We got okay. It's called a handgun. So I never forgot forget. So let's continue. I could take the doors. Let's take the doors. Why not? I mean, if I'm going to plunder this dungeon for everything it has, I may as well actually plunder it for everything. Repeating it, actually everything. Running out of room though, so put you in here. Drink one of these so I can just shove you in there. Oh, a tally counter. Displays how many monsters you killed. That's cool. Uh, throwing knives. Uh, what else could I put in here? Either bones? Nah. The platforms. And for now, that'll be it. It's a good thing we can just chuck that thing down whenever you need to. Bow, 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 bow. There we go. They coming down here. Is that a toilet? Okay, I thought that was a ch I thought that was a toilet for a second. Let me get rid of these doors because you can never have too many doors. Slime! Slime! Hey, buddy. You are perfect. You are what I need. You know, the spawn rates of the slimes are actually being a lot more calm. Ooh, the magic missile. Now, this is a magic weapon that not only shoots a missile, but shoots a controllable missile. What do I mean by that? Well, if I use the weapon... Uh, where is it? Right here. Ooh, boom. 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 Die. Whoa! That actually scared me. Oh my gosh. Swarming me. Get out of my face. Terror. Nightmares. Do I already have... Uh, yeah, I do. Flaming arrows. I actually don't need to throw them out. We'll take the gold because those thrones in my house are quite expensive. And I'm not going to say anything more. They took 60 gold bars for at least uh, two. Please get out of here, jellyfish. It's not even a dungeon mob. Why would you be here? I mean, did you want to live your life as a dungeon mob? I mean, I'm not saying you shouldn't do it. I'm just, I'm just saying it's something I did expect to see. I mean, you can have to go for your dreams for all you like, friend. I mean, I'd like to see some dungeon jellyfish. Watch as in Journey's End, they add dungeon jellyfish. I'm calling it right now. Whoa, look at all these magma banners. I'm going to take every single one of them. Ooh, this place looks barely lit up. Lamp. Lamp. Sigil. Lamp. Ooh, Furch. Furch. Oh, bull. And also a gothic workbench. No. Get drafted by the bees, my boy. Light this area up because it looks unlit. Oh, probably just because it was only the lamp that lit it up. Don't worry, I got torches, so you don't need to do your job no more. You are retired with pay. That's actually a good dream. Retirement with pay? Is that, you, you're working by doing nothing at this point. Who wouldn't Who wouldn't not ask for that? I don't know, unless you're a determined boy. Ooh, bookcase? More lamp? Nice job showing up. You, you kind of messed yourself up there. But I will take this lamp. Ah, uh, keep forgetting the doors. Who could forget the doors? Oh, look, another bowl with a workbench. And also another chair. So two chairs there. Door. Another workbench with that. Light. Man, I'm just taking this place apart. Man, I am doing a lot of things. There's that. There's that. Is that a lamp? That's a lamp. Oh my gosh, the wall skeletons. Or like the catacombs. Oh, game freezing. Game frozen. Gonna not. Don't want to do with that. That'd be scary. Hey, look, a water bowl. Take that. What's that? Adapt? Or adapt? If you don't know what water bolt does, I'm not sure if I. He silenced me, didn't he? No, he cursed me. Whoa. Here you go. Water bolt. This weapon is actually really awesome. I will say that right now. This weapon is amazing. Probably one of the best magic weapons you can ever get. And that's only in pre-hard mode. Oh my, dark casters, dark casters. Are... What's going on? Is there something good with you? You guys should take a chill pill once in a while. I don't need any more books so I can store that. Magic bolt. The, the flaming wheel. I swear, where, where are these? I'm picking these catacombs. Where are these plebs coming from? Wall Skeleton, I will surely take that. There's a water candle over there, interestingly enough. Ooh. 
Don't think I've been here before. Definitely a lot, which, that's a dart trap. I will take that. Is that... Okay, those, they're just yours. I don't think there are any such things as gothic toilets in here. Let me just search up here. You never know what you're going to find. Life is like a dungeon in this game. You will never know what you'll find. Water cannon, though. I'll take that. Oh, another dart trap. Son of a... Get out of here. I don't need you. Uh, store that. Also the dart trap. Where is... This works. This game is really irritating me with the off-camera dark casters. I will say that right now. Evil. Like, seriously. Like... Oh, it was a dark trap that I took out before. <laughs> I got scared by my own smartness. Switch. I wonder if any, any mob of enemies are down here. Maybe if I stay here next to Candle, then I can really get a grind going. But just look at this. They're all just coming. Here comes more of these. Oh my gosh, 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 oh my gosh. Bow time, bow time, bow time, bow time, bow time. I want these, you know, I'm going to purposely dig because I want these guys to come over here. Now, oh, I got a heart reach potion. That's cool. I'm going to actually eat a pumpkin pie just because I can. And, uh, really? Another tally thing? Yeesh. Game, how many are you going to give me? Think I already have enough? I have one. Which, wait, there's another. All right, I actually didn't see that one, actually. I legit did not see that one. Okay, what should I store? Man, this is a big, this is a big, uh, play where I gotta do stuff. Clothing rooted all, handgun, uh, magic missile, uh, the banner, and, uh, yeah. Yeah, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do something improvised. I can't open that yet, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna dig over here, make a tiny little hole that they can go through. A little crawl, wait, let me, let me go down a little bit. And they're gonna be able to climb up here. And that will increase this little grinding place tenfold. Because they'll just come after me, and I won't even have to move a finger. And let's be honest, laziness... Ooh, that makes everything feel better in life. Of course, this sucks having to mine through all of this. Even I have, like, one of the most powerful pickaxes you can have. It sucks. probably put a few torches down there we go okay we're about to break through there we go and now we dig through and look at all the skeletons be prepared here they come uh oh no no just invade them with bees Your beehive, your beehive, your beehive has poured into your house. By the way, did I mention that I've there? There are now bees inside of my house now. I'm not even joking. There are actual bees inside of my house. Like I don't know where they came from, but now they just exist. And now, so no, no joke. Saw three of them today. There was one, like, like there was one in the bathroom just on the sink. I have no idea why it was there. It wasn't even flying. It was just on the sink. And not like, you know, on the uh, little, you know, water faucet thing. No, it was literally inside the, the little bowl in the sink. Where all the water goes down. Near the drain, basically. Luckily, bees can easily go down to Febreze. Which, honestly, I thought they'd go down to something a lot stronger. Like, I don't know, Raid or Exterminator. And I'm not saying don't kill bees. I'm just saying I was scared. <laughs> I don't know where they came from. Literally, out of my 18 years of existence, I've never seen a bee in my house. Like, no joke, actually. I've never seen a bee inside of my own house. Like, honestly. Okay, another thing. I don't have a key again, though. Which, honestly, it kind of sucks, because 
I was already on a roll with three of the good slimes and stuff like that. Maybe I can set up a little grinding thing to help me. I mean, I got those boys down there ready to just go crazy. Oh, dang it. I don't need to deal with these dark casters. Maybe if I built platforms for them, then maybe, just maybe, they can get up. But I'm not sure how to organize this. Maybe I can do it off camera. And it's going to be a lot of work just to try and figure out if it'll work or not. But, eh, whatever. As long as I can get uh, an ex absurd amount of keys, then I should be set. Uh, I know there's a bone pleb behind me. Get out of here. Get out of here. Uh, where haven't I gone? I think it... What? Oh, it was just my imp shooting fireballs. I got scared for a minute. I think all of these mobs actually have a small chance to drop a key. Or maybe if I find some of those uh, skeleton things, they can drop a key for me. Or HP, that works. Okay, water candle up there. Break that. Okay, torches. Oh, wow, you're setting me up with more, more of the furniture. I don't even need to go to Ikea anymore. Oh, nice pathway. Oh, the frozen chest. I didn't find this yet. Let me, uh, pick some. I don't think I have those banters yet. Banter. Uh, bees. Okay, layer it. Yep. Please, let me place them. Don't go away, don't go away. Okay, thank you. Ah. I'm full on inventory. What do I do? Get rid of them. There's another one. Stop. Please, stop. I don't need. Oh my gosh, this makes my heart race. I'm storing everything. I just need to make room. Son of No. Stop. You violated laws. You can pay this court a fine, or you can serve your own sentence. Whatever you've been holding, you can forfeit it. No? Alright, then pay with your blood. Or if you, your bones. I guess. Pay with your bones. That'd actually be more strangely cruel yet oddly funny way to say it. Then pay with your bones. I, no wonder they say it like pay with your blood. Saying pay with your bones, that's way more weird. Because what do you see before bone? That's right. Skin. But they're not going to tell you to pay with your skin. Don't despawn. Don't despawn. I saw it down there. We have to run to it. Don't de- Thank you. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Wait, we have two? Where did I get the other one? I didn't even notice. Maybe I was just focused on mainly adventuring now. Well, let me open this one. Maybe it contains something new. Hey, that's something I actually want. The shadow key. Now, this is going to be interesting. It's for opening shadow chest. And that's something that we found in hell or the underworld, I think. If if I did or if I didn't, either way, those are useful. Is there a chest down there? No, that was one of the important chests. I'm not saying that these chests are important. Where am I? Okay, I'm right there. Uh, there's a chest actually nearby, if the game doesn't have a stroke on me. Uh, so let me go ahead and open that real quick. Uh, should be just right over here. Yep, right on top here. And it's another Aqua Scepter, but superior, so it's better than the last one. Uh, I just want one more thing. I'm pretty sure there's only one more thing I can find. It's actually one of the most important items that I need. Well, I still need keys. I have chests upon chests upon chests. And scores upon scores upon scores. Oh, what? what? Guess what? Hey, look at Nazar! This immune to the curse. This is gonna be really helpful for another item later on. Trust me, it's gotta be helpful. Can you get? Thank you. It's not a key, but I definitely will take. Speaking of which, my inventory is already freaking full. I gotta store more. Don't need bombs. Eh. I got another tell. Am I? I'm full. I'm full again. I can't believe I'm playing full. 
again. Give me the keys quickly before I'm just filled to the brim with tally markers. Or tally counters. Seriously. I don't need to keep up. I got enough. I swear, this feels like iTunes. And it's just like, oh, do you want to update to 0 .0 0.0.0.7? You're like, no, I don't. All right, five minutes later. Do you want to update to 0 .0.0.0.8? No, I don't. All right, two seconds later. You want to update to 0 .0.0.0.9? How many times do I got keys telling you no? And I'll even press the box where it says, oh, don't come back. Don't show up again. And they're like, fine. And then it still keeps coming because it's like, oh, it, it doesn't count because it's a new version. And then it's just like, don't you know how Don't Remind Me Again works? Alright. You should know. You guys are smart to know how the branding of iTunes work, right? Yeah. And Fleming, do it. Seriously. Top 10 things that irritate me, which I really shouldn't care about. In fact, they don't even irritate me. I just brought it up because I was running out of conversation. I'm a sad person, guys, I know. It's a good thing I got these bee friends. Things that, the sole things that are infesting my house, I'm using to protect me. I think I tried to say health and house. Which, honestly, kind of the same thing. Golden key. Great. What I needed. Is there one up here somewhere? Just don't kill me. There's two over there. So hopefully I can wander on up over there to get them. I will take these alchemy lanterns because they're actually pretty cool. Okay, someone's shooting their water ball wasn't me. And I don't want that. Get out of here. Get sliced and diced. So, specifically the flying skulls, I at least know do drop the things. Oh, I thought I picked another one up for a second. Opening this one. There it is. We got it. The Cobalt Shield. Now, what the Cobalt Shield is, is that it basically gives you immunity to, I think, it's knockback. Yeah, it gives you immunity to knockback. I'm going to take this. And you know what? I'm about to head up out of here. Because I got too much stuff already. Now, I can store a couple of things. Because, uh, these things are going to be used for later. Trust me. But, I do need just make a couple uh yeah this is still long term uh, so i gotta store that in there i think tally i gotta put somewhere as well so like that and there's more things but specifically what i also want to do is with the cobalt shield is actually a real good item this grants immunity to knockback and grants immunity to fire blocks but what i can do is that i can go over here combine them both and get the obsidian shield which grants immunity to knockback and fire blocks and honestly, I have the money, so I can go reforge. I mean, we have a lot of money. Uh, really? 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 Warding. I'll take that. I'll put it somewhere, but I don't know where. Oh, I can just replaced the flower boots. I really don't need those. I'll just put them in here. Anyway, I think that's where I'm going to end the episode. If you guys did enjoy, then please be sure to leave a like on it. And also share it with your friends for more terraria content like this and if you like my terraria content or like my content in general then be sure to subscribe to the channel for more content like this and also if you haven't or you're looking forward to be sure to hit the bell icon next to the subscribe button to receive all of my future notifications on this youtube channel but above all else i will see you in the next video hail the hype bees